Well, good evening, greetings, and salutations. This is Passionate Bliss, and I am here with just a comment on a few things I wanted to share with you. Um, just some things I've been noticing when I've been out in these YouTube streets and I've been scrolling through the media. You know, I've been a registered nurse for 22 years, but, I, but if I had not decided to be a registered nurse, I was going to be a teacher. So I'm going to channel my inner teacher, and I'm going to send a note home to the parents of Chris Brown and Kodak Black. Okay, because I've seen that Kodak Black um, has said in the street that he doesn't like black bees that are his own color. And I've seen that Chris Brown said he only Fs with black bee. He only Fs with black bees with good hair. Okay, so now these children are running amok in the streets. Okay, disrespecting black women of all color. And so I feel like if I send a note home to their parents that they can get them together. They can get them in order, get them straight, okay? Because, um, you know, when you come from a good family and a good home, a mother and a father is able to somehow get through to their children and get them straight. So I'm gonna send this note home to the parents of Chris Brown and Kodak Black because they're running amok and embarrassing the family, embarrassing the black community, embarrassing themselves, and they're attacking black women in the process okay you need to come get your kids come get your kids all right and you gentlemen who like to chant protect black women okay can you speak up now we're being attacked would you would you kind of protect us some right now i'd like to hear from you guys okay um you know and then you want to wonder why black women are so angry and so hostile because we're being attacked and no one is defending us. We have to defend ourselves. Can some of you black gentlemen please speak up? Okay, do we need to resurrect Tupac? Who said, uh, and I'll quote him, the blacker the berry, the sweeter the juice. The darker the skin or the flesh, the deeper the roots. Okay, see, I already know. They said that Tupac was in hiding I know Tupac is not alive because if Tupac was alive, he would come out of hiding and he would come and get these jokers together. Okay. He would speak up for us. He always did. So I know for sure that Tupac is no longer with us. And if I could resurrect him, I would so that he could get these clowns straight in 2019. Okay. Someone needs to come and get these children before they are expelled from school. I'm channeling my inner teacher. My inner teacher. We don't want to expel your child. We just want you to get your child together. Can you do that for us? Can you do that for us? To the parents. Okay, because my parents can always come and get me straight. They can talk to me now. I might not do what they say, but I probably will fall back somewhat. Okay, so hopefully the parents of this Kodak Black person and this Chris Brown person can get them together. And figure out why they hate themselves and their skin color. Okay, because every time I see Chris Brown, his hair is nappy to me. So I don't know why he's discriminating against, uh, you know, women <laughs> that have good hair. His hair looks nappy to me 90% of the time. So, um, you know, without going there, without making this personal, can you please come get your kids? Okay, come get your kids before we expel them <laughs> from our community and cancel them as people is calling for. You know, I want to give them a chance and a benefit of the doubt. And I feel that you as your parents, I'm going to send this note home to you and you're going to respond to it and get your child together. Okay. Thank you very much. And, um, have a good day to whom it may be concerned, et cetera, et cetera, you know, so on and so forth. Okay. Have sweet dreams. Okay. And wait to find them real.